maybe you call this rehearsed, maybe you call it the real thing, I don't know. It will be the first time I rehearsed, if so. Um, uh, oh, bad timing, sorry. Gas passing through an old pie of my ulcer. Anyway, um, hi, my name is Mike Wolf. I have a problem or two, apparently. Um, anyway, um, I've got some things wrong with me that uh, happened to me, uh, or are from something that happened to me. I actually suffered brain damage. Um, at a house fire in September 2004 and was exposed to lead paint fumes. Um, in case this is the one used, uh, I am medicated at the moment. Um, so that makes a couple of the symptoms a little worse and creates a couple of its own symptoms. Uh, side effects. Um, one of my problems is I have problems coming up with the right word. <laughs> my lookup table is, is kind of messed up. Um, anyway, uh, people very grossly misunderstand me. Um, I have emotional and personality issues that are beyond my control, and they affect my ability to uh, socialize. Um, I also don't have social skills, um, especially not anymore. Um, there, the problem is twofold there, is that American culture has drastically changed, um, and not for the better, and um, I have not participated in any of it, but I also never um, acquired social skills, because in starting in second grade, my teachers put me off um, at the corner of the classroom because of my intellectual skill or abilities and I was um, the uh, um, nature of my treatment was corrected on the playground um, by the, my fellow students. Uh, in other words, I was bullied um, and quite coincidentally I'm being bullied these days. Um, Uh, the only difference between then and now is that I had teachers on my side then. I don't have anybody on my side now. Um, sorry if I sound somber, but things are very bad for me. Um, I'm persecuted quite heavily. Alright, this is... Uh, hard to talk about. Um, I get bullied um, I just left a marina where I was threatened with death, I was threatened with having my boats taken away Sorry, I'm I try to do these objectively and uh, I don't always succeed. Um, I am going through a lot and it gets hard to deal with sometimes. But I do have trouble dealing with my emotions. Or my emotions have trouble with me, give me trouble or something. Um, get me in trouble for sure. Um, anyway, um, I know what I need. I need help, I need assistance, I need uh, just a roommate basically. Um, but a roommate that uh, earns 
um, to keep by um, doing most, if not all, of the housework. Um, and that's basically it. That maybe helped me keep organized and um, help me with a uh, therapy I've designed. It's actually just a rolls are, but it's like just a couple hours a day, if that, maybe a few hours a week. Ow. Mostly it's just being there to help facilitate my ability to conduct the therapy I've designed. Anyway, um, I don't need institutionalization by any means. That would kill me. Um, uh, I'll have to accept for now that that's a fact. Um, I can't explain later. Um, I can remember what I just mentioned. This is a symptom that's exacerbated by the pot, but is always there. And that is just forgetting what I'm doing, forgetting where I'm at. Um, this is a symptom of the dementia I have. Dementia is the symptom of Alzheimer's, where people forget where they are, who they are, things like that. And, uh, um, yeah, I have experienced all of that. And as you can imagine, just with symptoms like that, you know, it's exemplary of my condition. I don't need institutionalization. I don't need a living nurse. I don't need um, anything but someone there to, you know, bump the machine, get me uh, off the track, back on track. It's an old uh, vinyl record uh, reference. <laughs> I have a somewhat dark sense of humor that doesn't help my social appearance. Anyway, I want to quit saying.